Welcome. In a previous video, I talked about setting up basic guest Wi-Fi access on an Ingenious SkyKey 1, and the equipment I'm using was provided to me by Ingenious, but they're not compensating me for this video and they're not reviewing it before I post it. If you're interested in the SkyKey or the access points, I'll put a link to those in the description. If you use those links, it helps me out a little bit and doesn't cost you anything extra. So in this video, I'm going to be expanding upon the guest access, and I'm going to talk about setting this up with a username and password. So you'll, you'll want to watch the other video first before this one. So I'm logged into my Ingenious uh, SkyKey now. I went to click on projects, or I have my recent projects. I'll click on project here. And I have my fictional Rick Makes Mall. I'll click on that. And I want to click up here on Hotspot Service and go to Captive Portal. And this is where we set it up before initially. And I have the Mall Guest Wi-Fi. I'll click on the little pencil here. And if we scroll down here to authentication type, we can go to Easy Master Authentication. I'll click on that. If I hover over the question mark here, it says authenticate using Easy Master's internal user database. User must enter a valid username and password before being allowed on the network. So I'll do that. I'll click Save Change down here. It says Update Profile Successful. I'll hit OK. Then I want to click on Hotspot Service and click Guest Account. So in here I'll hit Add. So I'll say username is Guest and the password will be Free Wi-Fi. So typically you might have like uh, a sign up that says Use Guest and then Free Wi-Fi for the password or something along those lines. Let me make sure I did that right. And then people could connect to the Wi-Fi access point and log in and have access. So if you were in a deli and you set this up, you might have your username as guest and then your password might be whatever the soup of the day is or something. You might change that on a regular basis so people aren't connecting your Wi-Fi and hanging out in the parking lot and using it uh, all day long or all night long too. So we can hit apply here. I'll hit OK. And now I'm going to change my access to the free Wi-Fi. Okay, so I've chosen mall free Wi-Fi. In a second here, we should have a pop-up window. I'll type the username in here, guest. The password, I'll type free Wi-Fi. You can see the acknowledgement down below. I'll hit log in. And it says success. I can hit done. And now I can go to whatever website I want. So that's how you set up guest access with the username and password. Just so there's not any confusion, this isn't like a, an encrypted Wi-Fi access point. This is still an open access point, and when you go to it, you get the captive portal, and you enter the username and password on the captive portal. So if you have any questions about this, please leave it in the comments. If you like this video, please click like. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I'd appreciate it if you could do that. And thanks for watching. Until next time, goodbye.